before we start traveling home, let's say one last goodbye to Victoria Station. Okay, so we're at London Victoria. We need to start getting back to St Pancras. So I thought we would just take one final look and one final goodbye to London Victoria Station. We've got the 455 in there, we've got the 377. And yeah, so what we'll do is we'll just uh, walk over here, walk over to the 465. There, there's a 377. There's a 465. We'll walk over and then, yeah, we will then start heading towards the underground train because we are heading back up to uh, Derby via St Pancras. So let's get the Victoria line up there. Sorry, it's a little shaky. I'm just walking along. I've got my bag. I've got my suitcase as well. Oh, it'd be nice if that would have left, but nope. Sadly not. Oh, I can hear something going. Yes, yeah, a 375 going. Right, let's head towards that underground station and let's head out. Goodbye, Victoria. The next time we see you will be virtually on 212 Rush Hour. Right, underground time. Gotta say goodbye to their 465. Nine, yes, 900 series there in the 375. Let's go to the exit. Okay. We're now outside. Here is Southern Railways, London Victoria Station. Gorgeous weather this afternoon. But yeah, let's go. Oh, the underground's that way. Let's go towards this underground station and get down to the Victoria line. Okay, let's go down the escalators. So we're on the Victoria Line now, uh, Green Park, Oxford Circus, Warren Street, Houston and King's Cross, Compagnes. Yes, we are. Right, let's head to King's Cross, Compagnes, see what we got. We're leaving Victoria, let's go. start heading up to the train station to get our train home. Keep right. Got some time. Should we go and have a look at King's Cross. Let's go. So yeah, let's go up to King's Cross. Have a look at what we can see. This is London King's Cross. Excellent. Should we see if we can take a closer look? Well, there's some Thames Link for nine and ten, seven hundred. Uh. But it's there. Where's oh, the 377 there? 
387, sorry, 387. So yeah, just gonna keep looking around. This is as close as I'm gonna get from platform zero to eight. See an Azuma there? This is as close as we're gonna get without going through. I'm saying that, the gates are open. Oh, go on. Oh, the gates are open, let's do it. Oh yes, oh, the new first to Edinburgh's here. Oh my goodness, there's an Azuma. Oh, it's an Azuma coming in, but no, I am looking at this one here. This blue one here. That's what I want to see. There's a Grand Central. There's that new train that's going up to Scotland that's done by the first group. Or is it? No, it's whole trains. Is it gonna be here though, that one that's the first group? But yeah, whole trains. So my apologies, my apologies. I was getting all excited there and I'm like, no, it hasn't started yet. That is a whole trains one. There's the Azumas. Nice, love it. Love it, so good. Right, should we uh, go and have a look outside? Let's go. Because uh, things have changed. You know, it used to be that you would have um, all this area was kind of overrun with, uh, I say modern 70s like buildings and things like that. And it, it looked pretty bad, pretty ropey. But you got St Pancras. Wow, that sun is bright. But yeah, King's Cross. We are at King's Cross. Hopefully you've enjoyed that. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go grab a bite to eat and then we'll start getting our train, which is going from St Pancras International. I'll see you in a bit. I've eaten now, let's go to St Pancras International. I'm doing this for you. <laughs> right, let's get this heavy case. Right, see you at the top. We're up here. This is London, St Pancras International. How good would this be on Trade Simwell 2? I'm joking, right. <laughs> right, let's head in. I can see a Eurostar right there. First things first, put the mask on. Here it is, guys. So many Eurostars in. They're all the new ones. There's none of the old ones in here anymore. It's a shame. I like the old ones. There's the statue and the clock up at the top there. But yeah, there we go. When their lights are off, that means they're off off. So we've got one active, but all the others are just off now. So yeah, this is the downstairs bit. I don't have enough time to uh, go over to uh, Southeastern because uh, my train leaves in about five, 10 minutes. So we'll be going up those escalators and on East Midlands Railway. Probably a Meridian, isn't it always? <laughs> anyway, right, let's start heading home. Such a gorgeous, gorgeous station. It really is. But yeah, it's an amazing station. Yeah, let's go to one to four. Back to Derby. <laughs> Look at that. Europe's longest champagne bar there. 
It's always empty. There's never got anyone there. <laughs> There's the first class lounge next to Greg's. Still not open, I don't think. Yeah, that first class lounge for East Midlands Railway, it used to be the other end of the station, down the other end. It used to take ages to walk. Huh, looks like it might be open now. Anyway, let's get the train. Interesting, so these are new screens, but we've got platform 2A and 2B. So we need to go to 2A. That's ours. And then 2B, the one closest, is not ours. Oh, his microphone ain't working. Right, let's start going on it now. So, 2A and 2B, I guess it came down as a double, and then it's split. And now it's two singles going back. There's a 360 arriving. How cool is that? But yeah, three and four are empty. So, yeah, I think it was a double when they split it. And here is 2A. Where are they? So we're in coach B, seat 58. That's coach A. So next coach will be coach B. saw that Azuma on the way out on Sunday so will will it be here on the way back sorry about the reflection it's just you know it's night time so it's dark so you're gonna see my phone um, but yeah I want to have a look see if we can see the Azuma or anything else we could have gone could have left Should have done it a bit later. It's, uh, I thought we were very close, but we've still got that a little bit longer to get there. And there's the uh, Pride Park. Oh, it's so dark. 
Less CO2. Ah, there it is. There it is. Oh, there's a HST. Class 43 there. Hopefully you saw that. It was a bit dark, but we saw it. Anyway, right, approaching Derby now. And that's where we get off, get picked up. Right, let's go. Train's a bit filthy, isn't it? It's a bit dirty. There we go. Ready to depart. Those new high-pitched noise things are weird, aren't they? Instead of the whistle, we're getting that beep. Is it gonna go? Hey, we got a, we got a green. It was a double yellow. There we go. It took a while for those brakes to release. In the old colours, yeah, it does need a bit of a wash. Compare it to that one, it's a little cleaner. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I know it's a bit of a short video because we couldn't really uh, do anything uh, with, uh, we couldn't really do anything uh, on the train because it was so packed. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. This was another train real world. I am Mega Sim and I will see you on the next video. I'm out of here. See you later guys. Bye.